welcome back to the project awesome so i'm back and i'm really excited kasi ngayon na lang ako ulit gumawa ng video and this video is obviously from the title ng video it's a review of the cryolan tv paint stick and i've been using this product for a month now and I'm loving it. It's actually one of the best foundations that I've tried. It's a bit pricey. It's around 1,300 pesos, something like that, but it's really worth it because um, you're going to use it for a very long time since a little goes a long way. It actually looks like this. And actually, nakikita na ngayon butas niya sa gitna kasi um, ilang beses na siyang nagamit. So yeah, it has medium to full coverage. Actually, full coverage talaga siya. Itong Cryolan TV Paint Stick, ito yung mga ginagamit usually ng mga drag queens from the other country. And dati pinapanood ko lang to sa TV and then we finally got the chance to try it out, me and my sister. And yeah, so this in the shade FS45. From the video, pagka tinignan mo sa video or sa photos, yung pagka, um, pagka apply mo pa lang, yung wala pa siyang powder, mukha siyang mas maputi ng konti sa skin ko. Pero um, in person, pantay lang naman siya. So whenever I use this, I just, you know, um, use a translucent powder to set it para hindi na patong-patong kasi, um, Pagka natapos na yung buong makeup ko, naglalagay din naman ako ng translucent powder para mas tumagal yung makeup. So, para hindi na patong-patong yung mag apply ka pa ng, you know, colored pressed powder to set your foundation. Yung translucent na lang ginagamit ko, since kakulay naman ng skin ko tung FS45 na Cryolan TV Paint Stick. So, let's go straight to the coverage. So, like what I've said, it has medium to full coverage and sobrang full coverage laga as in matatakpan niya yung mga blemishes um in imperfections sa skin mo especially yung mga dark spots um etong ginawa ko sa skin ko ngayon isang layer lang yan pero i'm sure kapag ka you know dinagdagan mo yung layer if you maybe used to the three kasi yung mga drag queens talagang ang kapal ng pagkakalagay nila at talagang natatakpan yung mga alam mo yun as in parang second skin na siya so i'm actually used this to you know cover their brows at talagang effective naman siya kasi nga ang ganda ng coverage niya talagang natatakpan yung mga dark circles dark spots redness of the skin um broken capillaries um discoloration and yung mga blemishes talagang ang ganda ng coverage niya. and i'm not exaggerating ganun talaga siya i think this is what i'm going to use um to my clients sa mga gigs ko kasi other than its coverage other than its full coverage um, it's long-lasting as well kasi waterproof siya eh. So, actually, ginamit ko to nung nag-swimming kami sa Tagaytay just a few weeks ago. Um, nag-swim ako na ito yung foundation ko. Nung pag-ahon ko sa pool, may makeup pa ako. Um, hindi masyadong nabura. Actually, hindi nabura yung base ng ng makeup ko. Nandun pa rin foundation kasi nga waterproof siya. That's why I love this so much. So, this is what the stick looks like. So, kaya siya tinawag na Cryolan TV Paint Stick kasi nga ideal siya sa mga HD makeup. Yun, pagka may photoshoot, pag mag appear ka sa TV, kasi nga yung coverage niya. And, this is what it looks like. Ayan yung shade niya. As you can see, it's close to my skin color, lalo na pagka na-blend. So, let's try to blend that out. Yung gilid lang yung biniblend ko. Ayan. Actually, hindi nyo na siya masyadong makita kasi like what I've said, kakulay nga siya ng skin ko. And yeah, it's really amazing. So, meron akong balat dito. Let's try to cover that up. O, oh, ba? Ayan, nawala na siya. And then, we're just going to blend it. Ayan, you can barely see or hindi nyo na masyadong makita yung balat ko. ba? So, para mas makita nyo kung gano'ng kaganda yung coverage ng Cryolan CV Paint Stick, um, Watch the next clip. I'm going to show you how I apply this TV um, Cryolan TV paint stick on my face.
seen in the clip kung paano ko in-apply yung foundation. Um, there are actually many ways to apply um, stick foundations such as this one. So, ang ginagamit ko lang is, yun nga, yung nakita nyo kanina, itong brush na to. It's a flat top kabuki brush. And you can also use sponges. Actually, mga drag queens, usually sponge yung ginagamit nila. But, I'm actually not a fan of sponges. Maybe I'm just not comfortable in using um, in using sponges. Mas comfortable ako na gamitin yung mga ganitong brushes kasi, ewan ko, mas yun yung mas yun yung antag mas yun yung nakasanayan ko and para sa akin mas madali and hindi masyadong nag-absorb ng product yung ganitong klase ng brush unlike yung mga sponge kasi di ba nag-absorb sila ng product so kapag na-blend mo na yung foundation kasi nga usually yung ginagawa ko ina-apply ko muna yung foundation on a thin layer sa mga parts na meron akong you know imperfections and then saka ko siya i-blend using my brush and then mag-transfer man yung foundation na nasa face ko na dun sa brush nandun lang siya hindi siya na-absorb so later on you can still apply this and magagamit mo pa rin siya to cover the imperfections on your skin. So, I'm, I hope that you're getting what I'm saying. So, yun yung mga paraan kung paano nyo apply yung CV, um, Cryol and CV Paint Stick. And I'm sure na pag nag-search kayo dito sa YouTube, you'll find other, you know, YouTube gurus na gumagamit ng Cryol and CV Paint Stick, especially yung mga drag queens. Makita nyo kung paano nila i-apply. So, yun lang yung paraan ko. I'm just using, you know, kabuki brushes like this one. And that's it for the application for the coverage. Yun nga, nakita nyo na na-cover yung mga blemishes ko. Ito yung, kaya ngayon ko na sipang i-film, na i-review yung Cryolan CV Paint Stick kasi marami akong blemishes right now. Meron pang akong mga konting pimples um, sa iba't ibang areas ng face ko. That's why ito yung perfect timing para makita nyo na talagang nakocover nyo yung mga you know, blemishes, dark spots sa skin ko. Longevity, yeah, it stays on for long hours, gaya na sinabi ko sa inyo kanina nung nag-swimming ako. And then this is actually not ideal for everyday use since, since it has, you know, full coverage, pero minsan ito yung ginagamit ko sa school, lalo na pag nagmamadali ako. Pero hindi sa buong mukha. I just use this, you know, to conceal my imperfections. I'm sorry kung ang bilis ko na magsalita dahil ganun talaga ako alam nyo. Kung minsan pagpapasok ako sa school, tapos nagmamadali ako, o kaya gusto ko yung, you know, makonceal talaga yung mga imperfections ko, lalo na pag marami akong blemishes. Ito yung ginagamit ko. What I do is, I just apply this on the areas where I need concealing, such as my dark circles, sa gilid ng nose ko, and dito sa, um, sa paligid ng mouth ko kasi may mga blemishes ako dyan and then dito sa side, yun lang, very thinly o kaya minsan gumagamit lang ako ng brush, gaya ng ganitong brush, concealer brush tapos kuha ako ng konti and then saka ako i-conceal yung mga imperfections sa skin ko. This is ideal for full coverage makeup, lalo na sa mga formal events, atin kayo ng party, weddings, debut. So, so gaya na sinabi ko nga kanina, I think I'm going to use this um, sa mga clients ko kasi ang ganda ng coverage nga and it's, you know it stays on for long hours. Pero syempre, it depends pa rin sa skin type ng tao, di ba? Kung magwo-work ba to or hindi. I actually have oily combination skin. Combination skin, what does it mean? Nag-oily lang yung T-zone area. Pero dito sa gilid ng face mo, hindi naman. So, hindi naman din dry, pero hindi nag-oily. So, pagka may times kasi na parang dry yung skin mo, parang dull, um, na-accentuate niya ng konti yung mga dry patches. So, be sure na before you apply your makeup, before you apply your foundation, be sure na nag-apply muna kayo ng moisturizer para mawala yung mga dry patches, para ma-moisturize muna. Queen B, magkano to? I forgot the exact amount of the Cryol and TV Paint Stick, but I guess it's around 1,300 plus. So, dun lang sa lalagyan niya, ayan, nakita nyo, wala na siyang label. Madaling mabura, pero it's not that important naman. Ang mahalaga yung nasa loob, and it's really good. And for the shades, they offer a lot of shades. They offer a wide variety of shades, and I'm not... Um, I'm not familiar kung ano pa yung iba, pero they offer from lightest to darkest. Meron talaga sila yung dark, yung yung ginagamit ng mga drag queens, pang contour nila, pang highlight nila. And yan, makikita nyo yun, iba't ibang videos dito sa YouTube. So, I think that's it for this review. And if you have any other questions regarding this product, you can just leave your comments in the comment section below. And you can even email me at ivsc1989 at yahoo.com and you can even message me on my Facebook page, Makeup by Bean Castro. And please don't forget to follow me on Instagram and Twitter. It's beancastro89, pareho lang ng username. And don't forget to subscribe for more pro... <laughs> Silicon. And please don't forget to subscribe here in my YouTube channel, Being Project Awesome, for more product reviews and for more makeup tutorials and vlogs. So, kung meron kayong request na i-review ko or makeup tutorials na gusto nyong makita, um, you know, just leave your comments in the comment section below. So, yeah, that's it for this video. Thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you in my next video, you guys. Stay awesome and accomplish your mission. Bye!